Today we're taking a look at the ScanLogic series. This video is going to deal with how to disable a user. I currently have three users enrolled in this particular lock, but one of my users is going to go on vacation, so I want to uh, be able to remove his fingerprint, or actually disable his fingerprint, during the time that he's going to be away. So, how I could do that is, first of all, I go into the management menu by pressing the uh, putting my finger on the uh, the reader it opens as the manager now it goes to select menu and I can press the up or down button here to get to the menu selection I want and what I want to do is disable user so I press OK it now asks me which user I want to disable and I can scroll up or down here I've got one user here in, in, in enrolled so I'm going to just disable user 3 and it'll say disable uh, user 3 has now dis been disabled so in order to test that, I'm going to first place my user number three fingerprint on this uh, scanner, and it's going to verify and it's going to say, hey, ID 03 is disabled. So it doesn't delete it. It says, I recognize it, but you disabled it. So now I'll show you how to enable it. Assume he comes back from vacation. I put my management finger on here to, to open the lock. I get to the management menus. I can now press the up button until I get to... Enable user, and I press OK, and it'll look for users that have been disabled and say, are you sure you want to enable user 3? You say OK, and now user 3 is enabled. So, in order to verify that, I put my finger, my user 3 finger, on the reader. It reads, it checks, it says verified, and it opens the lock for me. So that's how you use enable-disable features on the ScanLogic series.